Hey guys, it's Rihanna and welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title of this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I bleach my hair and how I achieve the whole ash blonde, TWA, cute little blonde look. Um, and just a disclaimer, I'm not a professional, so I'm just showing you guys what works for me. Okay, so I'm going to start by showing you guys everything that I use. I use the BW2 Bleach Pack um, 20 Volume Developer. I use these two toners, the T18 and T27. Mixing bowl and a little mixer. I use gloves and shower caps. Oh, after I bleach my hair and after I tone it, I go in with this little protein pack I got from the beauty supply store, it's $2.99. It works wonders, 10 out of 10. So that is everything I use, and now I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do it. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what my hair is looking like, um, but before I take this bonnet off, I'm gonna let y'all know that whatever is underneath here does not reflect who I am as a person, okay? I just had to dye my hair in a little bit, so it was looking dry. Literally, it's not that bad, um, but you guys can see like my roots need to be done up and I need the protein treatment and all that good stuff. So let's get into it. Let's get into it. So first I'm just, ooh. So, so first I'm gonna start by um, opening up the bleach and putting it inside of the bowl in the bowl. I'm about to sneeze. Literally gonna sneeze. <coughs> okay, so once you have your powder in the bowl, you go in with our developer, 20 volume developer, and pour it. I'm sorry, I keep having to sneeze. I don't have like exact measurements or anything. I just mix and like I add developer and mix, and if I need more, I'll add more developer. But yeah, you want it to be like a nice yogurty pudding consistency. I feel like those are two different consistencies. <laughs> I feel like those are two separate consistencies. But um, yeah, I honestly might need more bleach but I definitely got another pack just in case I was being smart. So once it's like, once it's like this, like you see what I'm saying? Like a nice yogurty consistency, then you're good. Then you can start to bleaching. Um, I'm gonna go get a towel and I'm back. Okay, so once you have everything all together and your mixture is all mixed up, um, you just go in and apply it. I like to start from the back to the front. Um, I'm gonna speed up the process of me putting it in because it can take a little bit, but once I'm done, I'm gonna come back. Okay, so I'm finished applying the bleach. As you can tell, like on this side, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it already started like lifting on this side while I was applying the top. So let's hope, <laughs> let's hope this works out. Okay, so I'm just gonna put two um, shower caps on to really trap the heat in. All right, so I'm gonna leave this in. 
Okay, so I'm gonna leave this bleach in my hair for about 30 to 45 minutes. Um, I'll be back to show you guys what it looks like and then I'll show you guys how I tone. So yes, be right back. Okay, so I just washed out all of the bleach. Um, I washed it out using the Aussie Miracle Moist. Um, I really like the shampoo. I love the conditioner. I didn't condition my hair just now though. Um, I just shampooed the bleach out. And yeah, let me show y'all what it's looking like. Okay, so this is the color I achieved after washing out the bleach. And I'm actually very, very, very proud of it. Like, <laughs> not to be dramatic or anything, but I have never bleached my hair this good before. Like, I didn't even have to go in and do it again. I didn't have to touch up any missed spots, none of that. And I'm very... So I'm gonna go in with my two toners, my T18, T27, and mix them together. Um, same bowl, just wash it out. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I'm trying to tell y'all, the toner is stronger than the bleach. The toner stinks, it stinks, very strong. But um, G18, half, then I'm going to go in with my 20 volume developer. The amount that is in this bowl, I'm going to pour an equal amount of developer in it. Then mix it together. Now my eyes are watering. In it this is what it's looking like this is the color you're gonna get and the thickness that you want it's like a jelly type thing all right okay so i'm gonna apply that to my head i'm gonna speed it up and i'm gonna come back when it's all done So I'm gonna let this sit in my head for about 20 minutes. Then I'm gonna wash it out, protein treatment, and I'll be back to show you guys the final results. Okay, so these are the results I got after rinsing out the T18 and the T27 toner. Um, it didn't make that much of a difference, but I feel like it toned everything down, which is obviously what it was supposed to do. Like, that's what it was supposed to do. Um, I'm not really a fan of the platinum white color that my hair was beforehand. I kind of like this little, that's why I mixed the T18 and the T27 together, because I like how it still has like, it's kind of white, but it still has that little bit of like warmth to it. It's like a warm blonde and I love it. I love it. I love it so, so much. Um, so yes, if you want to spice up your TWA, if you want to just give yourself a new look for the spring or the summer, this is the look. This is the look you should go for. This is literally it. I feel like you cannot go wrong with this look. I feel like it looks so, so good on black women. So if you are debating if you wanna bleach your hair or not, bleach it. Bleach it. Please bleach it. Bleach your hair. Bleach your hair. Cause honestly, you can cut it all off and start over if you want healthy hair. I feel like hair is hair. But yeah, honestly, I love this color on me so much. I don't think I will be changing my hair color anytime soon. I don't even think I'm gonna be changing my hairstyle anytime soon. The only thing I really wanna do is put box braids in my hair. Um, I feel like my hair might be too short, but it honestly, I feel like if I really needed to do it, I could, I could grip that and put it in a box braid. I could grip this and put it in a box braid. Actually, yes. I think I'm gonna make a YouTube video of me putting my hair in box braids because my birthday is next month, I'm going to Puerto Rico and I really wanna have like blonde box braids. So I think I'm going to do that and make that a YouTube video. Um, I don't know though, but yeah, stay tuned, stay tuned. That pretty much wraps up the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you liked the video, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, 
share all that good stuff and i'll see you guys in the next video bye